everyone. It's me again coming back with a haul from CVS. This is my first haul from CVS. Can't say if I really like CVS or not, but um, I went in for an eyeliner. So I said what I'll, well, what I'll do is I'll try to get some other things and then I'll get my eyeliner last. Uh, what I did was the, the uh, Revlon deal where you buy the two Revlon tools and you get back $6 in extra care bucks. I did that. I ended up paying like my subtotal was five dollars and 38 cents out of pocket and i got six dollars in extra care bucks which i made like what 14 cents off of that and then i did the glade deal right here where you spend twelve dollars and you get four dollars in extra care bucks i used two one dollar printable coupons that i had off of smartsource.com and then i used a dollar fifty off one twin pack that i had from work i came out of one of the inserts i'm not for sure which one i think it was a red plum i'm not for sure though and i ended up paying i used my six dollars my six um dollars in extra care bucks along with those coupons and i ended up paying like five dollars and fifty cents for that which i thought was good for three of those and then i did my revline deal i mean my maybelline i did this eyeliner that i needed so badly and i don't know if you all can see this I hope Dear Love and Diva is watching this. Subtotal. Big old goose eggs right there. I didn't pay anything but tax for my uh, eyeliner that I went in there for. So this is my haul from CVS. I don't know if I'm going to be going back or not in CVS. It's going to take me a minute because I'm so used to Walgreens. And um, they don't give you as much on your extra care bucks as they do with Walgreens, but then again, Walgreens gives you a hassle about these fillers and stuff. So I guess these stores have their pros and cons, I guess. But I don't know. Maybe I'll try again at another time. But this is what I got from CVS, guys. Thanks for watching.